Hello friends, happy Tuesday. Welcome back to my channel. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Tara Stoddard and I am an independent color street stylist. Um, we do things a little bit different around here, um, if you're new here. Uh, let's do our manicure together. Every Tuesday, we come back here, um, we do our nails together, our color street nails, um, and I do a new manicure, like I said, every Tuesday. Um, and we talk about everything ever. I don't know. We, <laughs> we have a lot of fun. Um, and if you're not in my Facebook group, go ahead and join us there because every Monday I go on Facebook live and, um, we talk about what I'm going to do for today's video, talk life, um, talk color street. I don't know. Um, Yes, and if you hear some background noise, um, you might know my sister and her four kids and her husband, um, they're staying with us. I have five kids of my own, so it is chaos here. So if you hear some noise, um, that's that's why, because there's, there's 13 people in my house. Um, so for today's manicure, we're going to do Under the Stars. Now, if you saw yesterday's Facebook Live in my group, um, oh, if you're not in there, I have it linked in the description. So go ahead and click that link and come join us. Post your nail fees in there. I love it when everybody, um, interacts with each other and, you know, post their nail fees to the wall. But if you were on there yesterday, or if you know me in general, you know that I have such a hard time. I'm shaking the camera. I have such a hard time, um, choosing what to do. What, cause I, oh my gosh, there's so many choices, right? Especially because we just had 27 new shades added to the catalog, um, including spot on. So t technically 26 brand new ones and then including, um, spot on. My other choices for today were all fired up. It's a little bit sheer and somebody suggested, I think it was Carrie, I think it was Carrie suggested I put it over Beijing Beauty, which is a solid red, um, which would really make it pop. Oh my gosh. I really want to do that one, but I don't think I'm going to do it today. I'm not feeling red this week. My other one was Gleam On. Yes, these are both from the Prism FX, like the new category that we have for glitters. Um, you can see they're like, oh my gosh, they're so gorgeous. But I wanted to do this one because it's like that rainbowy like holographic sheen to it. They're so pretty and I haven't tried them yet. But when I saw Under the Stars at conference um, over the summer, I knew I had to wear this one. Um, and when I finally saw it in person, I noticed that it was like an ombre. It goes from like a navy, it looks like a navy star to like a sky blue. And I was like, oh my gosh, that would look so good with Aspen Sky. So I think that's what we're gonna do today. Um, so let's get right to it. It's done. It's, it's being opened. Uh, and I always worry about how my camera angle is. I hope y'all can see. Um, cause it's always a little different every, every week. I love it when I get this one. This one is my favorite, um, my favorite design on there and the other rainbow one. So I'm not going to use the prep pad, um, because my nails are already they're already pre-prepped. Um, however, if you need to use the alcohol prep pad because your nail beds, um, either you haven't washed your hands super recent or you put on lotion, um, the alcohol prep pad is a good idea. So <clears throat> let's, oh man. Okay. I was wondering how this was going to be. So this one, the smallest one fits my pinky. I really, I really small nail beds. Um, I was really hoping that was going to be the stars. So these two fit these two fingers. Um, and then this one fits my thumb. So that's okay. We'll have this. Okay. It'll work out. Um, I was hoping to have more, more stars than, than these ones. These are going to be my leftovers because I don't, I don't typically use those sizes or this big one. But I think we're going to put this on my ring finger. Um, and I think we're going to add a little something to the end. So last week I kind of teased you all a little bit with, oh my 
gosh, I can't open this. <laughs> with the nail decals that I bought, and I didn't show them on here, but I did post a picture in my Facebook group. I think I'm gonna use some today. I was looking at them. There's so many. I feel like I got a really good deal because um, not all of them give you as many sheets. And I hope that they're good. I hope they're good quality. We'll see. Um, okay, so we're gonna do we're gonna do our pinkies here. And I had to, I trimmed my nails pretty short. These ones were really long. They were getting super long, and all the rest of my nails were breaking. Um, but we're going short today. All right, here we go. And I was also wondering how sheer this was. I have not seen this in person yet. It's not sheer. I mean, it's, you can kind of see, you can't, I don't know, you can see shadows behind it, but you can't really see through it. And I was really, really curious about that. Um, I'm glad that I got to open this and use it. Um, Cause you know, like on, I was wondering how it compared to Home Sleet Home. If you've used that one, you know it's a little, ever so slightly sheer I'm going to show you right now but this one oh my gosh it's like a it has a white background already to it it's not just the glitter so that's compared to I'm pretty sure that's home sweet home I really need to label these um and I was thinking this looked so much like home sweet home until I saw it in person and I was like wait no that's different like this is you can see through this one it's not quite as sheer as Shangri-La, which I don't know if you can even see how sheer that is. Can you see? Um, they're both pretty sheer, um, but that is surprising in a good way. I like that. I really like that. The glitter on this actually reminds me of um, of Soho, Soho, so over it, so over it. I, I can't say, you know what I'm saying. Um, it reminds me of that like really thin, thin glitter. It's, it's slightly different, but you know, you know what I'm saying? I hope maybe you don't, I don't know. <laughs> okay. There we go. Oh my gosh. I love that. I love that. It's not sheer. Because I was thinking, oh, maybe I'll put Aspen Sky under it. But no. Um, it's, it wouldn't show through. It would be a waste. Uh, because it's not sheer. And I like that. I like that it's not. I've been waiting for like a, a white glitter like this. Um, I can't remember if we've ever had one that was that was similar to this one. Maybe as a an accent nail like this, but I don't think we've had a white glitter by itself. And like the closest you can get to this is putting Swiss Intel, which is a solid white, with Home Sleet Home over it. But even then, it's not the same kind of glitter. Because like I was showing you, Home Sleet Home has those chunkier pieces of glitter in it. This is all super fine, super fine glitter. Um, so we're going to take off this excess. Okay. So for my ring finger, let's see for my ring finger. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, what if we do, Hmm. Okay. I think this is what we're going to do. Do I want, I don't know. Maybe I don't, I don't know. So here's what I'm, here's what I'm thinking. I was either going to do just a solid solid aspen sky on my ring finger with nothing nothing else on it but then i was thinking what if i do this first and then i put that over it i don't know i don't know what i want to do oh my gosh hard decisions here mm. oh my gosh i don't know i really don't know let's let's leave it for now we're gonna leave it for now and we're gonna think about it um i'm sure i'm probably I might get some comments saying, oh, you should do this, you should do this, and then I'm gonna already decide, and I'm not gonna see any of the comments, of course, until after I post the video. Um, sometimes I wish I was doing this live so that, oh my gosh, which one is this? What am I doing, what am I doing? This one goes here, right? What, 
I'm losing my mind. No, this one goes, yes, this one goes here. Oh my gosh. I confuse myself every time because that first one fits this finger better and the next one fits this finger better. Oh my gosh. And I should have, um, I should have saved it. I should have done what I don't normally do and that's use that for this side. Let's see if I can, let's see if I can very carefully, um, let's see if I can do that and we'll clean that up later. Now that I've touched it with my finger everywhere, it's probably not going to stick as well. Um, but I do want to save a little bit this time because I like to put it on my little clear, um, nail stick. I'm gonna have to get some more of those over here. Oh my gosh, my cuticles are so dry. We were talking about this um, on my Facebook Live yesterday. Let me clean this up. That I really need to get into the habit, the better habit of applying a cuticle oil every day. And somebody in the group said that she applies it every night. She keeps it right by her bed. And it's like part of her nighttime routine. And I need, I need to do that. I need to make it my routine. Okay, and then we're gonna go like this. And normally I don't do this because I don't know why, because I don't feel the need to. I never go back and reuse sets ever. Um, I just, I don't. I have a whole freezer stash full of leftovers that I don't use and I probably never will. Um, I don't know. Sometimes I do, I've gone back a, a couple times. Very rarely though, because there's just always so many, so many good ones. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. So cute. All right, we're gonna do, that's gonna be, that's gonna go on my nail stick. And then these ones are for the middle finger. All right, here we go. Here we go. And yes, I am gonna, I am gonna waste it. I'm gonna waste it. Oh man, oh, I didn't stick, I didn't stick that just right. Oh, I stretched it. I stretched it. Oh my gosh. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, that's better. That's a little bit better. I think I got it a little bit on my cuticle. <laughs> Dang it. I'm going to have to go over that. I'm going to have to trim that off very carefully. Um, because when you get it on your cuticle like that, you can see the bump. Can you see the bump there? How it's just, you know just barely over my cuticle. When it does that, as your nail starts growing out, it's gonna like lift. It's gonna have that little lift. And then when you put your hands through your hair, it's gonna catch, drives me bananas, it drives me bananas. So I just take a little cuticle, um, little cuticle remover, and I will very carefully perforate it around. Dee, 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 dee and then just remove, I think I might have removed too much because I'm not paying very careful attention, but I don't want that on there and I don't, like that drives me bananas. I don't know about you all, but when it catches in your hair, when you, ugh, I just, I don't like that feeling. <laughs> all right, we're good now. Um, I didn't do a very good job at pushing my cuticles back this time. Um, but I am going to, take the advice of my group members and put a cuticle oil pen. I love Bliss Kiss. I have no affiliation with them, but I absolutely love it. It's one of my favorites because um, the, the little applicator pens are so easy. And I'm going to keep one by my bedside and I'm going to make it part of my nighttime routine like right before I go to bed, apply my oil, apply some hand cream. I need to, my nails will thank me. My cuticles will thank me. That is so cute. Okay, you know what I'm gonna do? I think this decided it for me. I am going to apply a full Aspen Sky just to break up these other colors a little bit. All right, I know I was, I'm, I'm so done with solids, you guys. I did solids all month, stepped out of my comfort zone. We, I worked with a lot of solids in August. Um, 
but we can have a we can have a little a little solid in there. All right, here we go. I like it. But you know what? My nails are so short that you can't even see the um you might be able to see it on my thumb maybe you can't see where it like turns into that lighter star color because <laughs> i cut my nails so short and my my nails are really sh like tiny anyway i have small nail beds and <laughs> it just doesn't show that's okay that's all right it still goes it still works all right and this one is a little bit slightly bigger than my ring finger here so I'm gonna have to just break up that edge I love how easy color she is to like fit it to your nail how easy how easy is that you don't have to use any kind of scissors or tools I just use my my fingernail just to trim the excess off um, and if you don't have longer nails that can do that you can use a cuticle, cuticle stick. Just, you know, perforate it right around the edge. That works too. Okay. Ooh, I like that. Do you like that? What do you guys think? What do you think, friends? I'm going to have all of these left over. <laughs> and one, one of these, because I saved it. Okay. Here we go. Get off. <laughs> Here we go. Thumbnails. So many stars. I'm glad it worked out this way because the stars were what I was wanting. And then I have a little tiny taste on my pinky of just that solid white glitter. So cute. I love that it's not sheer. Love it. And these ones are all, they are so big on my thumbs. So we're going to use a cuticle stick right now to break that up and remove that excess and then I'm going to use my nail file here I love this one this is my new crystal nail file I got it from hollow taco hollow taco um they do sell liquid nail polish <laughs> I feel like I, I felt like I was cheating I was like cheating on color street because I went to their website to order one of these but do you know how hard it is to find um, one that matches my love for my Sephora, which they don't sell anymore, my Sephora crystal nail file? Man, I have gone through so many. If you've been here for a while, you know my struggle. You know my struggle. I talk about it all the time, like how much I love my Sephora crystal nail file. And I could not find one comparable. <sighs> I've tried so many. All right, we're going to have to trim this. I think this, ugh, something's in my eye. I think this, um, this side's a little bit, my nail's smaller. That's a lot of excess. Or I moved it over. Oh, sticking to my, oh, sticking to my skin. My gosh. Okay. Now, I think we're going to do a little something extra. How much time do I have? Oh, I'm good. I'm good. Um, speaking of time, I somebody had mentioned like, oh, I know you think that we don't want to watch longer videos. It's not that, friends. It's not that. Like, I could sit here and talk to you all for so long. The problem is that it takes super long for my internet to upload longer videos to YouTube. Like, I think the longest one I had on here was like 40, 45 minutes, something like that. Um, and it took hours, like six hours to upload it. Um, so if it's under 25 minutes, I can upload it. Um, it takes like 30 to 60 minutes, depending. Oh, that's so cute. That is so cute. Um, but that's why I can't do longer ones because my internet, <laughs> I need to upgrade it. We have too many people using the Wi-Fi. Um, all right. Here's, here's some of the decals. Here's just two of the huge stack. Look at that huge stack that I found on Amazon. Um, but I was thinking I could do a fall leaf or I could do this, the moon with stars, with little yellow stars. But I kind of want to do 
the fall leaf. I know it's not fall yet. I know it's not technically fall. Um, we're going to get our little pointy um, tweezers here. But I have fall on the brain. And I think I'm going to do these little fall leaves. Um, man, they're all, they're so cute. They're so cute. I'm so excited um, to, for Halloween and fall to come. It is my favorite season. October is my favorite month. If I could get these up. Oh my gosh. Let's see. I thought it was going to be easier with, there we go. Oh, got it. Got it. Oh no. Oh no. It's coming. Oh gosh. Okay. I thought it was going to be easier with these. <laughs> it is. Um, okay. Here we go. Am I in the, am I in the camera? I don't even know. We're going to put it right, right there. Okay. It's sticking. Like I can't move it. <laughs> There it lies. I don't know that it really goes with the stars, but I don't care <laughs> because I need some fall in my life. Okay, I'm gonna do I'm gonna do this one now. Let's try to peel this up. And I'm thinking next month, because October today is August 31st, so next month is tomorrow. Um I'm thinking that I do. I'm gonna do Halloween. I feel like I need to. I need to. And I'm pretty sure that um, Halloween's gonna launch next month. So watch for that. Okay, how cute is that? Oh my gosh. I love that. How cute. Oh man, I'm so excited for fall. And then I'm gonna go over this with a clear um, top coat just to, just to seal that in. Um, it does make removing a little bit weird. Um, but they'll, they'll peel right off. I need to get that excess too right here. Cause that's gonna start lifting. All right. Oh my gosh. That's so cute. It doesn't really go with the stars. I don't think it goes with the stars, but do I care? No, it makes me happy. Oh my gosh. I love it. Do I need to do something else? I don't know. Where's the other, where's the other sheet? Where did I put it? I lost it. Oh, right here. Um, do I want to do something else? Maybe I could put these little itty bitty stars on and see what that looks like on the other side. Let's see if I can even lift that off. Holy moly, these are so tiny. Ah, oh no, am I ruining it? <gasps> these are so tiny. What is that going to look like? Oh, okay. It's going to, gonna have to it's just gonna have to live there you can't really see it. I wonder if those glow in the dark I got some excess right here let's put on another one because you can't really see it I wonder if some of these are glow in the dark I have no idea I guess I should have read the description a little better oh gosh come on we'll put one right right there you can't really see those <laughs> they blend in. If I if the background was a black, a solid black, it would have it would have showed up. But being on the light blue, it doesn't. So let's do. We're gonna do this moon now. We're gonna do the moon, and then we're gonna call it good. If I can lift it up. Oh my goodness. Oh come on. There we go. Okay. Oh. Let's see. I wanted to go this way. Ah. Okay, it's it, that that's where it goes. <laughs> that's where it's gonna go. The moon and the stars. It's not perfect, but it's there. I don't know if that really looks like a moon and stars. I would have done it a little I didn't realize how big it was. It would have looked better if my nail was <laughs> longer. But ah, I love it. I love it. It makes me happy. I know that they don't really they don't don't go together, <laughs> but that's okay. It's okay. I know if even if nobody else gets it, that that makes me happy. That makes me so happy. All right, friends, that's all I have for you today. I'm so happy I was able to get both hands done um, in the time that I am trying to go for. Um, and I can't wait to try out some of these other cute little. Oh, before I go, look at you guys. <laughs> so this is one of the ones that came. Do you see something wrong with this? Okay, I thought that said panty. <laughs> I thought it said panty. 
but no, that says party. It says party. Um, fonts matter. The fonts matter. <laughs> like I see what they were trying to do. I see it's a, you know, like a weird cursive, not cursive R. It's, that's not really an R. That looks like an N. That is an N. <laughs> that's terrible. Anyway, I thought that was really funny. Um, and I posted, I posted it in my group and I realized afterwards, I was like, oh my gosh, I don't know why that says pantsy on there. <laughs> oh, funny, funny. All right, there we go. I don't know if I love this one. I love this one though. I love the fall. Um, that's it for this week, friends. Thank you so much for tuning in. Um, again, come and join our Facebook group. Post your nail fees in there. Even if you don't buy from me, I love seeing your nail fees. I love seeing what you come up with, especially if you watch this and you try any of the things um, that I'm trying. I'm going to try something new next week also. Um, I think I am. We'll see. We'll see what I do. Um, but yeah, come join us in there. We love having friends. Um, and we have something fun coming up and we would love your help with it. Um, we have some voting, some voting going on. I'm not going to tell you anymore, but we have some voting going on and we could use your votes. Um, well, fellow members of the group could use your votes. All right. That's all. I can't say no more. I cannot say no more. Just come join us. Um, and I will talk to you all next week. Bye friends.